would be remiss if we did not pay tribute to the place where our rhythms come from and the birthplace of civilization. It's not Brooklyn or the Bronx.
Hidalgo. Amar Fajaya Sala. Pedrito Martinez. Giovanni Hidalgo. Oreta Abrantes. Irán El Pavo Ramón. Jason Villamar. Ian Stewart. Almighty Horns. Chris Washburn. Sharif Clayton. Jeff Letterer. And the one and only Peter Brainin. Ben Sutton on the electric violin. My name is Bobby Sanabri. Everybody had a good time? Nobody wants their money back, right? Okay, ladies and gentlemen, stay right there. LP's youngest endorser Freeze. is here tonight with us. At the age of 97, he is still miraculously performing. I know because we worked together like two weeks ago. Okay? He hails from El Cerro. Shh. Yo sé que todo el mundo está bellaco. No, que diga, tan excitado. You know? He hails from El Cerro district in Havana, where they say El Cerro tiene la llave because El Cerro means the latch. So El Cerro has the key. Shh. Everything that you saw Pedrito do, everything that you saw Giovanni do, everything that you saw uh, Orete do, everything you saw Eddie Montalvo do has its roots with this man who I like to call the father of modern conga drumming. He was the first to play two drums simultaneously. Napatato, he was the first to do that. First to play three drums, four drums, five drums, six drums. He developed this foot pedal that I've been using all night with my left foot. The Gajate bracket is called now, but he developed that in 1950. And I got the pictures to prove it, so if you don't believe me, come see me after class, okay? He has won the highest award that a living jazz musician can att attain from the U.S. government, the National Endowment of the Arts Jazz Masters Award. Not only is he an incredible conga player, but a bongo player as well, timbalero, and also plays drum set. He also plays the Cuban thresh, the mandolin guitar, cua, the bass, and he's recorded on those instruments as well. And it would be only righteous to celebrate his 97 years on this planet. Oh, also, shh, Harvey, relax. He was also in 1957 the first person to play a fiberglass conga drum. When other people looked at it as so, it's kind of a novelty or eso no vale or whatever, he played Frank Mesa's echo tone conga for the first time, and the world hasn't been the same since. Besides Willie Bobo, he is one of LP's earliest endorsers, and he is the greatest representative of this company's long heritage in terms of being culturally sensitive and aware to the needs of its musicians. So please, everybody, put your hands together so we can sing to Maestro Candido Camero a happy birthday. <laughs>
Now, who would like to hear Candido play? Candido, quiere tocar? Okay, we gotta bring the congas to you. <laughs>
very proud they got let me got to today special day for me especially with these people here beautiful que Dios lo bendiga a todos que God bless you everyone okay I want to thank my assistant Roberto Marrero aquí siempre so much for gracing us with your presence. Long live Latin Percussion Incorporated and long live Candido. Yeah.